Towering over the Nigerian savanna, a silent guardian stands watch. This is Zuma Rock, a natural sentinel that has stood the test of time, witnessing the ebb and flow of history, the rise and fall of civilizations, and the unending march of nature. Zuma Rock, a monolith of imposing grandeur, inspires awe and trepidation in equal measure. Its sheer size and the way it dominates the landscape make it a beacon of both beauty and mystery, drawing in those who seek to understand its secrets. For centuries, this natural wonder has been the source of countless legends, each more chilling than the last. Under the light of the full moon, the rock takes on an otherworldly glow, as if it holds within its stony heart the memories of ancient times and forgotten tales. Locals whisper of trapped souls and ancient curses, their voices hushed in the shadow of the rock. They speak of spirits that wander the land, bound to the rock by forces beyond human comprehension, and of curses that have lingered for generations, shaping the destiny of those who live nearby. Is it merely the wind whistling through the crevices, or do the rocks themselves whisper secrets? The textures and patterns etched into its surface seem to tell a story, one that is both ancient and eternal, a narrative written by the hands of time and nature. They tell of a time before memory, when spirits roamed freely and the rock served as a gateway between worlds. It is said that the boundary between the physical and the spiritual is thin here, allowing for encounters that defy explanation and challenge our understanding of reality. A place where the veil between the living and the dead is thin, where shadows dance in broad daylight and the air crackles with unseen energy. The rock stands as a testament to the mysteries that lie just beyond our grasp, a reminder of the unseen forces that shape our world. Zuma Rock is more than just a geological formation. It is a living legend, a testament to the power of belief and the enduring allure of the unknown. Its presence is a constant reminder of the stories that have been passed down through generations, each adding to the rich tapestry of its mythos. Its presence looms large, casting a long shadow over the landscape and the hearts of those who dare to venture near. The rock's influence is undeniable, a powerful force that continues to captivate and mystify, leaving an indelible mark on all who come into its presence. The history of Zuma Rock is shrouded in mystery, its origins lost to the mists of time. This colossal monolith, standing tall and imposing, has been a silent witness to countless generations and their stories. Legends and myths have swirled around its weathered surface, each tale adding to the enigmatic aura that surrounds it. Local legend claims the rock was once a powerful deity, worshipped by the indigenous Gwari people. They revered it as a sacred entity, believing it to be the dwelling place of their ancestors, spirits. The Gwari people would gather at the base of Zuma Rock, making offerings and performing rituals to honor and appease the spirits they believed resided within. They offered sacrifices to ensure the rock's favor and to protect their community from harm. One popular tale speaks of a great warrior who sought the rock's protection during a fierce battle. This warrior, known for his bravery and strength, found himself outnumbered and desperate in his moment of need, he turned to Zuma Rock praying fervently and offering his life in exchange for the safety of his people. His devotion and sacrifice were so profound that the rock itself seemed to respond. The rock, moved by his devotion, opened its stony embrace, concealing the warrior within its depths. It is said that the rock's surface cracked open and a glowing energy pulsed from within, as if acknowledging the warrior's sacrifice. To this day it is said that the warrior's spirit remains trapped within the rock, his anguished cries echoing through the night. The locals believe that his spirit roams the plains forever bound to the rock that once protected him. Some claim to have seen his spectral form wandering the surrounding plains, forever searching for release. His ghostly figure shrouded in mist and shadows is a haunting reminder of the ancient pact made with Zuma Rock. His sacrifice, forever etched in the memory of the rock, serves as a reminder of the power it holds. Zuma Rock stands as a testament to the enduring legacy of the warrior's devotion and the mystical forces that continue to shape its legend. One of the most striking features of Zuma Rock is the enigmatic face etched upon its surface. Visible for miles around, the face, formed by natural erosion, is a source of endless fascination and speculation. Some believe it is the visage of the ancient deity, forever frozen in a watchful gaze. 
Others whisper that the face belongs to one of the many souls trapped within the rock, a permanent reminder of their torment, their silent screams echoing through the ages. Their eyes, dark and hollow, seem to follow your every move as if searching for a way out of their rocky prison. Whether a protector or a captor, the face of Zuma Rock serves as a constant reminder of the unseen forces at play. A silent sentinel bearing witness to the passage of time and the stories whispered on the wind. The wind, as it whips around Zuma Rock, carries with it more than just the scent of dust and rain. It carries the whispers of countless souls, their voices faint but filled with an unspeakable sadness. These are the lost souls, they say, trapped within the rock's depths. Some were travelers, caught in sudden storms and seeking shelter in the rock's shadow. Others were villagers who dared to disrespect the sacred site, their punishment a fate worse than death. Their cries, carried on the wind, serve as a chilling warning to those who would tempt fate. Legend has it that the rock can sense fear, drawing strength from the terror of those who venture too close. The more you fear it, the stronger it becomes, its power growing with each passing year, and within its depths the trapped souls wait, hoping for release, their cries echoing through eternity. Section 5 the Night of the Red Moon, a harrowing account. The story of the Red Moon is one whispered in hushed tones, passed down through generations as a cautionary tale. It is a tale that has woven itself into the very fabric of the local culture, a story that both fascinates and terrifies. It is said that once a year when the moon hangs heavy and red in the sky, the rock awakens. On this night, the veil between the worlds is at its thinnest, and the trapped souls are at their most powerful. These souls, it is believed, are those who have been wronged or have unfinished business in the mortal realm. One man, a local farmer named Adebayo, claimed to have witnessed the events of that night. His account is one of the most detailed and chilling ever recorded. He spoke of strange lights emanating from the rock, accompanied by unearthly screams that chilled him to the bone. These sounds, he said, were unlike anything he had ever heard before, a mix of agony and anger. He described seeing spectral figures dancing around the base of the rock, their eyes burning with a cold, otherworldly fire. These figures seemed to be performing some ancient forgotten ritual. Adebayo's experience, dismissed by some as madness, sent ripples of fear through the community. The villagers, already wary of the rock, became even more fearful, avoiding it at all costs. His tale serves as a chilling reminder of the rock's power and the unseen forces lurking beneath its surface. To this day, the story of the Red Moon and Adebayo's harrowing account continue to haunt the memories of those who dare to listen. Section 6. The Rituals and the Reverence Despite the fear it inspires, Zuma Rock is also a site of great reverence. For generations, locals have conducted rituals at its base, seeking the rock's protection or offering appeasement to the spirits within. These rituals, often shrouded in secrecy, are a testament to the enduring power of belief. Offerings of food, drink, and even livestock are left at the base of the rock, a way of placating the spirits and ensuring their continued favor. Shamans and spiritual leaders conduct ceremonies, their chants and prayers echoing through the air, seeking guidance and protection from the unseen. These rituals passed down through generations are a testament to the delicate balance between fear and reverence that Zuma Rock inspires, a reminder that even in the face of the unknown, faith and tradition can offer a sense of comfort and control. Section 7 Zuma Rock in modern times, a tourist attraction with a shadowy past. Today, Zuma Rock is a popular tourist destination drawing visitors from all over the world. Its imposing size and eerie beauty are a sight to behold, but even in the face of modernity the legends persist, whispered in hushed tones by tour guides and locals alike. Tourists flock to the site, eager to capture photos of its imposing presence, but beneath the surface a current of unease remains. The stories linger, their grip on the imagination as strong as ever. The rock stands as a silent sentinel, a reminder of the mysteries that lie hidden beneath the surface of our world. The stories of trapped souls and ancient curses continue to fascinate and terrify in equal measure. 
a testament to the enduring power of belief and the enduring allure of the unknown. Section 8. The Enduring Enigma of Zuma Rock Zuma Rock stands as a testament to the power of nature and the enduring allure of the unknown. Its history, shrouded in mystery and legend, continues to captivate and terrify. Whether you believe in the supernatural or not, there's no denying the eerie presence of this monolith. Is it truly a prison for lost souls or simply a natural wonder? The answer perhaps lies somewhere between belief and skepticism. In the whispers of the wind and the shadows that dance across its surface. Zuma Rock, a silent guardian, a keeper of secrets. Its presence a constant reminder of the mysteries that lie at the heart of the human experience. Its story, a tapestry woven from legend, fear and reverence, continues to unfold with each passing year.